Today's video topic is, is there a difference between renal failure and kidney failure? Kidneys play an important role in the human body as they filter waste and excess fluids from the blood and maintain the body's chemical balance. They also help regulate blood pressure and produce hormones that regulate red blood cell production and promote bone health. The word renal comes from the Latin word renalis, which means of or relating to the kidney. Kidney failure, also known as renal failure, is a medical condition in which the kidneys are no longer able to perform their functions effectively. There are two types of kidney failure, acute and chronic. Acute renal failure. Acute renal failure is a sudden and temporary loss of kidney function. This type of kidney failure can be caused by a variety of factors, such as a serious injury, dehydration, blood loss, certain medications, or an obstruction in the urinary tract. The symptoms of acute renal failure can include swelling, nausea, confusion, and anuria, which is a complete lack of urine production. If caught early and treated appropriately, acute renal failure can often be reversed. However, if left untreated, acute renal failure can quickly progress to chronic renal failure. Chronic renal failure. Chronic renal failure, on the other hand, is a gradual and persistent loss of kidney function over time. This type of kidney failure is often the result of long-term conditions such as diabetes, high blood pressure, or glomerulonephritis, which is a type of kidney disease. Chronic renal failure may not cause any noticeable symptoms until the condition has become quite advanced. When symptoms do appear, they can include fatigue, weakness, decreased appetite, and weight loss. Over time, chronic renal failure can also lead to other health problems such as anemia, nerve damage, and heart disease. In both acute and chronic renal failure, the kidneys are no longer able to filter waste and excess fluids from the blood effectively as they once could. As a result, these waste products and fluids can build up in the body and cause serious health problems. In severe cases, kidney failure can lead to anemia, nerve damage, and even death. So it is very important to catch and treat kidney failure as early as possible to prevent serious health problems and ensure the best possible outcome. Diagnosing kidney failure can be done through a variety of tests including blood tests, urine tests, and imaging tests. Treatment for kidney failure depends on the underlying cause of the condition and the stage of the disease. For acute renal failure, Treatment may involve correcting the underlying cause, such as removing an obstruction in the urinary tract or discontinuing a medication that is causing the problem. For chronic renal failure, treatment may involve managing the underlying condition, such as controlling diabetes or high blood pressure, and taking medications to help manage the symptoms of the disease. In severe cases, a kidney transplant may be necessary. In conclusion, the terms kidney failure and renal failure mean the same thing and are used interchangeably by doctors. Whether acute or chronic, kidney failure can be a serious medical condition that can have significant impact on a person's health. It is important to know the symptoms of kidney failure and seek medical attention immediately if you have any of these symptoms. By working with your doctor, you can ensure that your kidneys are healthy and functioning properly. Thank you for watching our video. Please do not forget to like and share the video. Also, please subscribe to the channel to stay updated on our latest videos.